Hey, how's it going guys? Wonderful here, and today I'm going to be showing you all of the best scripts for Jailbreak after the new prison update. And as you can see, these are all four of them right here, and they have some insane features on them, like a really fast airdrop farm. There's a ton of settings for your player, for trolling, and if you are trying to use any of these scripts, you're going to need an executor that actually works after the new anti-cheat update. So the one I'm going to be using, which actually works on all these scripts, is called Vega X. It has no keys, and you can actually search for these scripts directly in the GUI. So yeah, I can see right here, there's like 100 jailbreak scripts in here. And starting off with the two best scripts, that's going to be Evo V4 and Sensation. And Sensation is going to be getting updated a lot more than Evo V4. So even though it looks like this one might have a little bit more features for now, they're going to be adding auto robs to this. They're going to be adding a uh, trolling server hop, tons of other cool features on sensation. Uh, along with that, uh, all these scripts have no keys on them. And if you want the auto arrest, that's going to be on my script called flare hub. But yeah, so here's what it looks like. You can come over here. You have ESP. So I could use ESP for all the players in the game. So it's drawing tracers to this criminal, to that cop over there. And if we keep moving through the map, you're going to see it's going to start showing more people. There's a prisoner way over there, and yeah, pretty cool feature over here. There's a combat tab where you can actually kill people with this really, really fast shooting gun. The script has the same thing over here on the combat tab. You can click to send lightning bolts anywhere you want, just like this. So pretty cool. And again, if you want to use any of these auto rob features, they're going to be added very soon to the Sensation GUI. If you want to open up any door in the game, you can click this button right here, and it's going to open up doors for you. And I think what I'm going to do for this video is show you each of these GUIs one at a time because they are kind of interacting with each other in a weird way. So like this one might mess with the other scripts. The first thing I'm going to show you is the player tab. You can open up infinite, infinite jump and walk speed, fly around through the map. You can make your walk speed actually pretty fast. And this game actually doesn't detect you until you go above 150 walk speed. So you're going to be completely fine. You could also give yourself guns. So baton, glider. What else do they have here? Let's equip all owned guns. There we go. So now I have this like black hole gun, the shotgun, all this type of stuff. And we can also go on the combat tab and enable, uh, let's do police aimbot enabled. And we can come over here now and do the hit chance. You could change all these different settings if you really want to. Here's what the FOV circle looks like. Let me increase that. We could also do no bullet drop, uh, no knockback, rapid fire, automatic. And now if I pull out my pistol, as you could see, it shoots a lot faster, I'm pretty sure. It's like a fully automatic gun. We can do the ESP and try to find a cop right here. Okay, so it looks like there's a cop over here in this police station, so let's try to kill him. As you can see, I'm just shooting right near him and it's still doing damage. So let's catch up to him really quick. Okay, he's going really, really fast. The one thing this, that, that this script does not have is a perfectly working uh, wall bang. So if they're like in their car, it might mess up. I think this guy might know that we're trying to kill him, but we should still be able to get him. I don't know if you can kind of tell here, but I'm like shooting near the car. And there we go. He's dying. And there we go. I think he's dead. Right? A couple more bullets. Yep. So this might be a little bit more useful if you're a cop because there's going to be more criminals walking around. You can go get them. I think that gives you a lot of battle pass EXP. Okay, so I just switched to the cop team now and I'm going to change my targets to criminals and prisoners. Come over here to the visuals tab and change it to uh, criminals and prisoners. And then I can come over here and kill all of these guys right here. So I should probably be able to do this to criminals. Come over here. Okay, so it's kind of buggy as I said earlier. So you have to shoot them through their windows. Okay, never mind. I had the target set wrong. So if I come over here, I could actually be above them. Flying in the air. And then shoot them. I think they're trying to fight back, but let's see if this works. Okay, so once they start moving, we have to catch up. Let's go in front. And shout out his tires. Here we go, he's taking some damage. Yeah, it's not really the best combat tab I've ever seen. Yeah, moving on, you also have the uh, robberies tab, which is coming soon. The server tab, which is coming soon. And then some settings you could change. You can show your FPS, which is pretty fun. You can also do a draggable UI, which I think that's for this actually, yeah. So yeah, pretty cool feature. You have infinite zoom, so I can zoom out, obviously, infinitely, zoom back in. You could do the uh, remove fog, remove rain, remove all this stuff to make the game look a lot more smooth and make your FPS higher. Okay, now we'll move on to the second script, which is going to be Project Evo V4. Because here's what Project Evo V4 looks like. They have a fly feature, which the other ones don't have. You have the auto parachute, which is kind of useless, to be honest. I don't even think that works. 
Okay, so yeah, you have the infinite jump, you have the speed. I don't know what's going on with the map here. Maybe my internet's kind of bugging out, but that's what it should look like. This is where you like fly in the air. You have the auras, so arrest aura if you're a cop, and then the eject aura if you're nearby a car. We can try to find a car here. I'm going to click on eject aura, and if we can find somebody sitting in their car. Okay, so yeah, my game is really like bugging out right here. Yeah, my ping is just really crazy today. As you can see, I'm teleporting over here. It's just bringing me back again. I guess I'm just going to have to do the rest of this video like, oh, okay, stop doing it. So yeah, as you can see right here, okay, you have weapons tab. You can give all the guns in the game. Equip, equip, equip. This should be working right here. Again, it's really buggy. I've been trying to record this video all day, but unfortunately this is not really cooperating. You have the give all guns. You could do the same thing as the other script. You could give yourself ammo for any of these different things. So I could buy like one at a time or you could shoot everybody's tires in the game. Yeah, so I'm not going to be able to showcase any of this today because it's not really working. But yeah, it should be working for you guys as long as your internet's not horrible like mine is right now. Hope you guys liked this video. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you can. And as always, peace.